Hello everyone, Spidey Fist here, and I'm going to be talking about how to unlock second costumes for all of the characters in Street Fighter VI. So the easy way to do it is going to be going to the shop and getting fighter coins, which you have to pay real money to get the fighter coins. Uh, and I think it's about $30, maybe like $25, to unlock all of these second outfits for all of the characters. Uh, alternatively, you can go into the world mission mode, and you can level up the bond with the masters in the game. Uh, there is a couple ways to do it. Uh, one is going to be talking to them, sparring with them, and then the one that I'm going to show you to do in order to get your bond up to 100, which you need to have it at 100 in order to unlock that secondary costume, that is going to be giving them gifts, and gifts cost a fair amount of zenny, so I'm going to show you how to get the zenny that you need to get the gifts that you need to give to the masters in order to get the costumes that you need. Uh, essentially, whenever you're playing the game, you're going to come across things that can be broken, uh, such as trash cans and other items, and you just attack those, and then sometimes they drop coins, uh, also, you can go up to any of these characters that you are able to fight outside. Uh, looking at Daryl, uh, it says here if we perform one wall jump, we're going to get some zenny after the fight is over. Uh, we're going to get about 1300 for that. Uh, and then the way that I prefer, and probably the fastest way to do it, is going to be to come over here to Junkyard Smalls, and he has a mini game that we're going to go into. And basically, all you got to do is you got to beat up some junk. Whenever you destroy all the junk, you're going to get gold for it. So we're going to do that real fast. Okay, only took us a few seconds, and we got 2400 zenny for it. So that is a very, very fast way to do it. Uh, you are going to be able to get, uh, in about 30 minutes, you'll get enough for one costume worth of gifts that you have to give a master. Uh, so you can get about two costumes per hour doing this. Uh, some of the gifts are more expensive and you have to know where to go. And in order to do that, uh, I'm going to leave a link to a website that has all of the, uh, the gifts that you need to give and the location for each master. So I'm in Jamaica now because that is where I have to go in order to buy the Red Elevator 8 gift for Luke in order to get him up to level 100. He's already at level 5 and each gift that you give is going to give 5 points, meaning you need a total of 20 if they are at zero. Right now, I've only got to buy 19 of them. Okay, and we're giving him his last one. Brought him up to level 100. Obtained outfit two for Luke. And it is that simple. Go do the scrapyard stuff. Save up a bunch of money. And then buy the gifts that you need. Give them to the teachers. It's going to take you about 30 minutes per master to get each costume. Uh, it's going to take you a couple hours to do it this way, but at least you won't have to go and spend $25, $30 in order to get all the costumes that are already in the game. But that's it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. Like and subscribe, ring the notification bell and all that stuff. But I'm Spidey Fist, and I'm out of here.